annoyed with you guys, but you guys are so annoying. Like, seriously, I'm a weird guy diaper. Shut up. I'm just gonna end stream. Like, literally, I'm done. I'm, like, not streaming. So before I get into today's video for you guys, I want to mention that the content in this video may be found to be triggering. And some of the topics that will be brought up will include eating disorders. So if that's something that you're particularly sensitive to, I'd suggest that maybe this video isn't for you and I'll see y'all in the next one. But with that being said, today we are going to be talking about someone who has been a very hot topic for a really long time. He seems to be surrounded with controversy and conspiracy by by, at the very least, just existing. And if you don't already know who I'm talking about, today's video is all about Eugenia Cooney. Eugenia Cooney was born on July 27, 1994, making her 27 years old at the time of making this video. She started her channel back in 2011 and has been uploading videos to her channel for over a decade now. Most of Eugenia's videos consist of outfit hauls, makeup reviews, and the occasional vlog where you can see Eugenia go about her everyday activities. So all in all, if you had only heard about her channel from that brief description, you may be wondering what makes Eugenia so controversial. All of the above mentioned topics seem completely typical with any other girl starting a YouTube channel. Well, what sets her channel apart is something that is glaringly obvious when you take a first look at her videos, and that is her body, particularly how thin she is. Now, before we go any deeper into talking about Eugenia, I just want to mention that this video is in no way an attempt to shame Eugenia whatsoever, as she is obviously battling with a terrible illness. However, if when watching this video, you feel like you may be going through something similar to what Eugenia is going through, I will leave some links to different resources to contact if you feel like you may need some support. However, moving back to the subject, Eugenia's appearance has always been something that has kept people returning to her channel for years now. But sadly, people do not return to engage with her outfit hauls or makeup reviews. The main thing that draws everyone back to her channel is simply morbid curiosity, as so many viewers just seem to feel the need to check how she is doing or or unfortunately to check if she, for horrible reasons, isn't active anymore. So as I mentioned before, Eugenia's body has played a massive part in the success of her channel and how much it has grown over its 10 year lifespan on YouTube. But when 2019 rolled around, Eugenia posted a video that took people's breath away with disbelief and sadness. It was just like any other of Eugenia's videos where she was cosplaying and trying on different outfits that showed off her figure. But now more than ever, people really saw just how severe her condition was getting. And some users even pointed out how her legs looked particularly pink in color, which could be due to her body not being able to pump blood properly anymore because she was just too weak and fragile. Along with this, people commented on how her eyes and skin on her face were a weird yellowish color, which could indicate that some of her organs, like her liver and kidney, were failing. And on top of this, viewers speculated that she was wearing a wig in the video to hide that her hair was falling out. Fans and other viewers, some who had never even come across Eugenia's channel, pleaded for her to seek help. And thankfully, not long after this video was posted, Eugenia made a tweet explaining that she had in fact been taken to a rehab facility in order to treat her disorder before her body could give up on her. And six months later, in July, Eugenia returned with a brand new video. Eugenia had an incredible transformation. She looked much healthier and seemed a lot happier and more comfortable in front of the camera as she explained that she has been getting help in a rehab facility and was in the intermediate stages of her recovery. Everyone was completely amazed by just how much healthier she looked, and an overwhelming amount of support and love came her way, with people being so happy that Eugenia seemed to have gotten better. Even the now infamous YouTuber Shane Dawson made a whole docu-series with Eugenia, letting fans have an inside look into her life and recovery. The series received mixed reactions. A lot of people condemned Shane for the video, accusing him of being money hungry as he was only making the video when Eugenia was trending all over social media and also because the invasive content of the series could have damaged the process of the YouTube star's recovery. Despite this though guys, a large percentage of the viewers looked past this and instead showed up to watch the docuseries to show their support and express how proud they are of Eugenia for seeking help and getting her health 
Following Shane's series, the weeks went by and Eugenia was back to posting her typical content, this time with a new refreshing glow. And as well as this, made videos talking about mental health and how she has struggled with it, and giving her following advice and encouragement on where to find support. But as the weeks turned into months, fans unfortunately started to notice that the glow of Eugenia's new self was fading away. And as of today, she seems to have relapsed into her disorder with eating. Also, Eugenia has in the last year moved away from posting to her YouTube as frequently, and instead now streams on the popular platform Twitch, where she sits at her bedroom desk for sometimes hours throughout the day. What's even worse, you guys, is that the live chat on these streams is packed full of haters, leaving horrible comments about Eugenia's body that are purposely trying to encourage her to fall deeper into her illness. And a lot of these haters even pay pay directly into the stream, which forces Eugenia to have to interact with these disturbing comments, which usually leads to Eugenia awkwardly dismissing the hate or occasionally breaking her positive character and showing how distressing the comments are to her. And so that brings us to the present day and the current situation with what is going on in Eugenia Cooney's day-to-day -day life. So as I mentioned before, in the last year or so, Eugenia has been posting less frequently to her YouTube channel and instead can be seen a lot more on the streaming platform Twitch. And she can be seen on Twitch for the entire day, sitting in her chair by her desk for 12 hours straight without even any bathroom breaks. And in these streams, viewers can donate money to Eugenia to basically have her view a comment or request. And this is where people's sympathy towards Eugenia's sweet and innocent persona begins to shift. As one of the most concerning accusations that has been made is that Eugenia is actually using her ED for profit by doing random things to please creeps on her lives. An example of this is Eugenia having her makeup box in frame every time she goes live. At first glance, nothing seems too suspicious. However, a few people started to notice that in every single stream, she would for no reason at all decide that she needed to pick up her makeup box and move it around her room. And when she did this, just like magic, she would receive cash tips from some viewers, as the creeps watching the stream just wanted to see someone who had a very weak body pick up something heavy or do strenuous tasks despite their condition. Another reason that Eugenia has been surrounded by a lot of controversy is also the most obvious one, which is that the content she makes could be extremely harmful to young kids that manage to find her channel while scrolling through YouTube. As many of you guys already know, Eugenia has been pretty popular on YouTube for over 10 years now and countless people have come forward saying that they watched her videos when they were young and heard Eugenia claim that she was just naturally skinny, which made her young fans look at their bodies differently. And some of them even ended up with eating disorders as well. My friend had a gallery full of pictures of her. She's in a clinic right now. When I met her at a mall in town because she lived near me and she said she was naturally skinny and 10-year-old me was like, gonna try to get that skinny. The way she said she was naturally skinny ruined my perception of bodies as a kid, and it took so long to feel okay in a healthy body. A couple of years ago, just before Eugenia went to rehab, there was actually a petition to get her channel taken off of YouTube, as people recognized how harmful her content was to children and teenagers. But for some reason, it seems like she has gotten away with all of the mass reporting and is able to carry on making her disturbing content. And the worst thing that Eugenia has been called out for is actually being a liar. This all properly came to light when a TikToker called Maya Papaya explained how Eugenia has been trolling her audience for a while now, and how she has been leaving hints around her social media captions to suggest she is encouraging other people who are suffering with eating to cheat their recovery and stop seeking help for their condition. This all came from a blue butterfly emoji that is seen in a ton of Eugenia's Instagram and Twitter captions, which Maya pointed out is a symbol for a community of girls that teach each other how to keep fueling their illnesses. And the clues were even as blatant as Eugenia posting a quote, which when you look up the words on Google, take you to a link to buy a book about a girl that had 
Alexia. Despite all of the accusations and controversy, Eugenia seems to be planning on staying to her exact same routine, and unfortunately gives off the impression that she doesn't want to try to make a second recovery from her disorder. But with fans realizing that the idea of her getting better again grows more and more hopeless, they have all slowly started to fade away and leave Eugenia to the haters that bully and harass her on Twitch. What do you guys think of Eugenia Coney? Let me know down in the comments.